you guys. Uh, time for some more August Wins Red. I can't wait. Um, so, as some of you guys might notice, I have a new guitar. This is going to be a Ibanez RG Prestige. Um, 10th Anniversary Limited Edition. Something like that. It's really nice. Fast neck. I like the sound it produces. It's very nice. Um, so, let's get to Empire. I'm sure some of you guys are trying to learn the solo. So, I took a couple hours the other day to try to figure it out. And I think I got it. But... We'll see what you guys think. So, I also have tabs associated with this video uh, for the solo. And just send me a message with your email, and I'll send them over to you. Okay, so let's start off simple. First rift. Okay, some of you guys are familiar with redemption. I'm using those notes, okay? Also, this is going to be more like a follow on. I'm not going to go over every single fret by fret. So, if you guys want to want the tabs, just send them to me and just go through the tabs while you watch the video. So here we go. First, first riff. Okay, watch that again. Oops, don't do that. Okay. That's what the first one sounds like. Second riff could maybe be a little tricky. A lot of people just keep going. I keep hearing a low note in between the higher notes, so, and I've noticed that I think JB plays it with his thumb, but I'm not going to play with my thumb, that's a ridiculous way to play it, because it's hard. So, let's cover the 8th fret with your index finger, and just hit it. It doesn't sound very good when it's slow. Once it speeds up and you can get a little clean, it sounds a lot better. Just try not to hit any of the strings. Okay, so here we go. Okay, that's what we have so far. Next riff. Here you go, the second string. 8, 7, 8, 10. Same thing on the third string. And then on the fourth string, it's going to be 10, 9, 10, 12. Fifth string, 10, 8, 10, 13. So what's that going to sound like is... gonna work. Here's what we have so far. Okay, next riff. To go to the fourth string. Okay, 12, 14. Fifth string is gonna be 13, 15. Last string is gonna be 12, 13. So, so going off the last part of it. After this, you're going to slide to 20, and back down to 15. Okay, I'll explain that last thing in just a second. So, here's how this looks sound, um, going slow. Okay, that last note kind of sounds a little out of place, but more what it is. It's actually like a lead into the to the next riff, okay? So um, play it one more time for you guys to take a look at it and we'll move on. Okay, here's what the whole thing sounds like so far. Okay, next riff. So, go and listen to the last riff and how that 12th fret right there is going to just lead into that next one, so. That's how that works, okay? So, try to hit it. I don't think it really matters if you hit it or not. If you want to be 100% with the song, yeah, hit it. But, it's, I don't think it's a vital one that everybody's going to be pissed off at you about. So, here's what, here's what it sounds like. slow that's how that's gonna sound okay after that it's gonna go don't do that I keep doing that okay that 
the A fret right there is, is the first note of the, of the next riff coming up after this, okay? So here's what we have so far. <laughs> so far go and take a look at the tab and just kind of match it over and it'll all make sense okay now that last riff i'll throw this in there just for fun because i think it's pretty catchy so okay how oh, this sounds slow it sounds really sloppy when you play it slow but maybe it'll help you guys okay so that's how all that works okay here's the whole thing I clearly still have some work in for me, but going through it slow, I'll eventually get it. Let's just see what it sounds like with the, with the music again. Yeah, get a full view right here. that thank you guys for watching i hope this helps you guys um my empire cover should hopefully be up in about a week i'm still working on it and hopefully i hope i can make you guys proud any questions just send me a message i hope you guys have a wonderful day